What's up beautiful people? We are just en route to Worcester. Hannah's friend works in a cafe there, so we're gonna start our day with a coffee and cake. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna have a nice day out. We've arrived in Worcester. It's like a 45 minute drive from Birmingham. It's like 30 miles or something. What's the car park called? We are parked Cattle in Market. Cattle Market car park. Um, what about Worcester? Cathedral city. Population's like 100,000, I think. And what's it known for? A canal. No, well, yeah, it has a canal. Think about it. Worcester. Liam Perrins. Oh, Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. I would like a cake. That's what I'm gonna get. Or some brekkie. I got another fact about Worcester for you. Go on then. It was where the last battle of the English Civil War was fought. Really? Yes. How do you know? I read it on Wikipedia. <laughs> Cheers. Successful brekkie. That was so good. I had a massive stack of pancakes. No, you didn't. They were. You had their crumpets. <laughs> oh yeah, they were crumpets, egg dip crumpets. They were so good. I had a veggie breakfast because I haven't eaten enough vegetables recently, but I got it because <laughs> I love avo and halloumi and hash browns. So that was yummy. And very, then... very good place. What was it called? Way Wayland's Yard. Wayland's Yard. Highly recommended. And. Thanks, Ioni, for my little message. Worcester's got quite a lot of charity shops, which Hannah's a I fan like of. I like to go to. And we're on the lookout because we want to buy some new, uh, like tumblers, glasses for the for the flat. So we're going to go on a little bit of charity a mission. Shop bar crawl. What do we need that for? I'm not sure. It's really nice. It's nice. We don't need it, but... <laughs> that. <laughs> tweet, tweet! <laughs> that is a great that teapot. That is outrageous. That would make a really nice, like, vase. Yeah? I like it. Southern Comfort. The first success. Which one was it? Headway. Headway. Sounds very fun in there. <laughs> oh, there's so many. One, two, three. Another one just here. It's like a grenade. It's a pineapple, isn't it? Pink pineapple. Last one? This is our last chance to get a charity shop gin glass for Hannah. Apparently that's what we were meant to be looking for. I was just looking for normal ones. I like that. It's a bit weird. Well, we got one thing, not the thing we were looking for. Right. But a semi-success. Next up, we're heading to... El Catedral. El Catedral, Worcester Cathedral. And just on the road down to it, Got a nice little weekend market. With some tasties. There are some real tasties on, on show. <laughs> it's taking a lot of willpower right now not to I get. <laughs> all of the goodies. What did you do? Edward Composer, Elton? wasn't he? Was he? He grew up in Worcester apparently. Around the 1860s. Wowza! Bigger than my head. 
Look, here we are. Reach the cathedral just as it's starting to rain. Perfect timing. Do you have to pay? So it is free entry, but they've got someone standing there as you walk in who asks you to make a six pound donation if you can. So we made one for both of us. Amazing. The present cathedral church was built between 1084 and 1504. In, oh, and represents every style of English architecture from Norman to perpendicular Gothic. Nice. It's famous for its Norman crypt. Ooh. I think that's the oldest bit. But yeah, that'll be the oldest bit. So the Norman crypt is from the 11th century. We'll see if we can find it. Through there, it looks like one of those mirrors. No. Locked. I think it's locked with all the scaffolding. They're like restoring it. it looks Must like be. It. They're like almost always having to restore these buildings, aren't they? I know, they're so old. Yeah, they're on every column, but they're like very well hidden. Yeah, that's a very good spot. I hadn't even noticed. Yeah, Got eyes like a hawk. Come for a nice little river walk along the River Severn. Does this Got go all the way down to like Bristol. Western Superman? Yeah, I think so. Wow. We're not going to be walking all that, that way today. That would be a long time. That would be a long walk. Got some very cute houses up on here as well. With nice views. We were saying we imagine that the insurance is probably <gasps> Flamingo. a lot. Ah. Look how cute he is. I like him a lot. I love him. Got some rowing going on over here. So nice. Oh yeah. See the, the window. Jungle in there. That is nice. Over here is the Malvern Hills. And if you want to check them out, I've got another video on the channel. So this is an island that was built and they've locked it on the other side. And what's this called? This Down here? Weir. It's called a weir. So it allows um, a larger volume of water to change levels quickly so that it helps like stop flooding and things like that. So because they locked, locked it yeah, on the other side? They needed a bigger volume of water to be able to get through. So that meant that they put the weir in and then that had like a huge impact on some of the, no worries, some of the that fish. had an impact on the fish, some of which were super rare, like swimming up the, up the river. Up the river. So now apparently they've put a little pass next to the weir where fish can get around it somehow. Like a fish lane. A fish lane. I think it's called fish pass. Oh, is it? <laughs> That's cool. The river's reach opens to all and the shad a welcoming silver song. They don't look very happy about it. <laughs> yeah. You should be pleased about it. That's a slightly better view of, of what it looks like. The fish pass. A series of 11 ascending pools allow fish to swim up past the weir in manageable steps. To finish up our time in Worcester, we headed back to Impasto, the restaurant playing the funky music that we walked past earlier in the day. For a starter, we shared the Indua sausage pate, something that I've never seen done before. And it was a beautiful texture and flavor, but it certainly packed a kick of heat. We followed it with a couple of top-notch pizzas and left feeling very full and happy to have stumbled across this lovely restaurant. 
A doggy bath. And there's a little bit to take home. A doggy bath. <laughs> Very good day exploring Worcester. There are like a load of other things you can do. National Trust, historical places. We just took a lovely walk down the river. Yeah, I think we had a good day. Very yeah, good definitely. day exploring. Um, cold, but dry. Cold and dry, mainly dry. If you've enjoyed this video, please do leave it a like and consider subscribing to see some more. Ding. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Big love. And it feels good around here. That could be dangerous. Dangerous. That girl is so. Dangerous. That girl is so. Yeah. Big up Ione in Wayland's yard.